In other news, when disaster strikes, we don't always have time to react and plan. Many of us have already experienced severe weather events recently that have put us in danger. NBC 26's Jenna Bree tells us what one local family is doing to always stay prepared. You never think it's going to happen to you, but once it does, it's too late to prepare. Megan and Skylar Benaboos put together go bags before the storm that had ripened just a couple weeks ago. We actually prepared them the night before because we knew that the storms were going to be bad. So we had the, our go bags ready by the door. So then when we woke up in the night to our alerts on our phone, we were able to just grab our bags and, and run to the basement. But Megan says growing up, her family always made go bags, packed with water bottles, food, copies of important documents, batteries, and other essentials. We both feel like it cut down the, the time of scrambling to find important things that we might need. Um, it even just made us feel confident to be able to just up and leave when we need to. The Binabooses go bags are now something that Jehovah's Witnesses, congregations all over the U.S. go over at least once a year. An emergency go bag is something that probably 30 years ago we didn't really think much about in much of the country. Maybe down in the south of Florida, perhaps in the Gulf Coast, maybe in California for earthquakes. But now when you start seeing derechos like we saw in uh, Iowa, when you start seeing uh, um, natural events, disasters that are happening everywhere, uh, we know that all of us need to prepare for disasters. But regardless of faith, the Binabooses want everyone in the community to learn from them and be prepared. I think it would be important for everyone to be prepared to react in a moment's notice because you never know. If you want to put your own go bag together, all you need to start is a good sized backpack. And we've got a full list of recommended items that you can put inside on our website, NBC26.com. In Green Bay, Jenna Bree, NBC26.